Hi, I'm the Messy Art Teacher. I'm going to show you guys how to add a Google Classroom. As you can see right here, I have the Google Classroom app already added. Okay, but if you want to be able to include, go ahead and add that app, you need to go down here where it says Web Store. Click on that. Go ahead and type Google Classroom. Do your search and enter. And then share to Classroom. Okay, and then you would normally hit the blue button. It'll have it blue, add it to Chrome, and then it'll add it to um, your op to your apps. Okay, but I already have it added. So, okay, so I'm going to go to my classroom. Okay, and I've already created one test classroom. Okay, um, there is a button right here, which if I hover above it, it's going to say create a classroom normally does. But if you click the plus symbol, you can just go ahead and either join a class or create a class. Okay, so um, since I'm a teacher, I'm going to go ahead and create a class. Click that. And then it's going to ask me, um, normally it doesn't ask you this if you're using a school account, but I'm doing this with my own Google account, my Gmail account, and anybody who has a Gmail account that if you're using it not for educational purposes, you can create your own classroom, add people to it. Um, if you are a teacher, you should, your district would um, have Google Classrooms as an option um, if you guys actually use it in your district, district. And I would just click, I've read it, and I'm going to hit continue. And then you're going to want to name your class, and I could call it um, this class room two and then if you want to give it a section section two subject um, I'm going to call it art and then it comes up with some different options right here I'm just gonna go with my art Oops. Go with the art and then hit create and then it's going to actually create a classroom for you okay all right, and this is just going through some of the options for how do you navigate around your classroom. And if I'm going to go ahead and say I got it, but right here there's these three um, horizontal bars that are stacked on top of each other. So if I click here, I'm going to see the actual classrooms that I've created. Okay, so there's my classroom one and two. I'm in classroom two. Um, then I can go ahead and if I want to change any of my, you know, select a theme. I click over here and then I can pick a different option, click on that option and select class theme and it will change the colors and the style of it. Okay. All right. And that's, that's it for creating the classroom.